taking a look at uh, Scratch DJ Academy's new software called Mix. Here we have uh, a, a window which is the library window um, and uh, I've already added 78 songs to this window. You can click on add songs here and uh, go into your computer and, uh, and uh, select any uh, digital track you'd like to add to the library. Once you've uh, imported a song into the library, uh, the software will analyze its BPM and key, the length of the song, and of course will give you the track titles and the artist name if uh, you had set up your track that way in your computer. Um, once you have uh, imported the songs you'd like to include in your playlist into your library, uh, you're going to uh, select uh, uh, a track and drag it this time into your playlist window, which is the window on the right here. Uh, and you can see the BPM and key again. Um, if you click on this track, um, the software will suggest uh, compatible songs uh, for your playlist, uh, uh, songs that would uh, match or follow or mix uh, the best with the song you've just highlighted. Uh, once you've dragged this song into your uh, playlist, you can also see the waveform of the song right here at the bottom uh, part of your screen. This is really, really handy because uh, if you need to uh, make some adjustments and uh, realign your downbeats, um, you just have to zoom in and you will see uh, your waveform in great details. We have this uh, this track highlighted and uh, we can see here some uh, suggestions from Mix. So I'm going to uh, look at my list. I have a, a wide a range of, uh, of uh, various uh, styles of music in this playlist. So I'm going to try to go for something that's a little bit more like along the line of uh, air. We're going to drag this uh, track into the playlist. Uh, now it's, uh, it's giving you a, a mix box right here at the bottom and also of course the waveform of the new song uh, you've, uh, you've added to the mix. Um, you can preview your mix by clicking on this preview button here. Here we go. Uh, that was a very smooth uh, uh, mix and uh, it worked perfectly well. Um, you can, uh, you, you can uh, change the mix length here. You have, uh, you have different options. You have a roll down window which gives you the option of a drop, one bar, four bar, eight bars. Uh, you can change your mix points uh, and this tells you how many mixes you've included in your playlist already. This is the cue uh, point adjustment. Um, so if you were unhappy with the mix, you can uh, uh, move your track to the left or to the right by clicking on plus or minus. This is the record uh, button here, uh, which will uh, record the whole playlist, including its mixes, uh, to a, a file, an MP3, an MP3 file, uh, so that you can put it on your iPod and, um, and, uh, and play it that way. The other thing that's uh, cool about this uh, this uh, program is uh, the Scratch FX here. Um, it has a, a few presets, uh, bass, fresh tone, and a customized Scratch FX, uh, which you can uh, insert into your mix. You, you might want to know how long your playlist is, and this is your timeline at the bottom here, which looks like a ruler. Um, we had a mix here at a little over uh, uh, three and a half minutes. Um, if I scroll to the right, at the end of this uh, song, we are at uh, a little over uh, 8 minutes. Uh, that's it for it. This is uh, quite a simple program, so I uh, uh, hope you enjoyed it. Bye-bye.